Uh, June 21st this month is when we are expected for all lockdown measures to be over and you guys are getting an exclusive so um, I will be announcing the return of the Poetry Camp, it's our second anniversary so we are back ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are back August the 30th, Bank Holiday Monday um, posted by yours truly, a lot of your favourite artists will be there Woody, uh, Big, uh, Big Scoop, Reed, Kobe Carter I'm not going to name who else, but yeah, just to name but a few, but we are back and tickets will be going on sale very, very soon. So if you're not following us, follow The Poetry Jam, which is D-A Poetry Jam on Instagram, YouTube, and follow all of the information there. The Mobiles. I performed at the Black Magic Awards in October 2019, which was dedicated to women across a variety of industries so it's paying homage to you know those respectable women um one of the ladies on the night that was receiving an award was kanye king kanye king is the founder of the moguls um prior to her receiving her award i was i went on stage and performed my uh i've got a piece which is called black woman so i came off stage she went and received her award and then came off stage and she was standing right next to me um, she congratulated me on my performance and um, we started talking and I said to her that I've got some ideas in regards to the expansion of spoken word. So she gave me her email address and told me to email her. So I did. Um, my email I didn't get a response for about a week and so I done a follow up email. So it took about two weeks for me to get um, a reply from her. So when she did reply, she said um, she she presented me with an opportunity to perform um, at a, a gig which is which is called the Market and Society. Every single major brand in the UK or worldwide you can think of was there. So Samsung, Tesco, Nike, Adidas, all of the brands were at this at this at this um, this dinner. And she asked if I can bring anybody else with me. So this is where I brought um, Mr. Reed and Poetis Jess, and this is where. The, the Wordsmiths, which is the group that we formed, was born. So we killed this show, this performance, and then from then more work started coming in from the mobile. So they started to build, um, we, we started to form a relationship, a trust, and a respect between all three. And then two weeks prior to the mobiles, which took place on the 12th of November last year, two weeks prior to that, I got a call um, from one of the directors, um, and they wanted to. Um, they wanted us to perform at the mobiles. So they gave us the concept, what they wanted us to talk about. So we started writing um, and we submitted about three different pieces before um, one finally got signed off because it was TV. There were certain things that we could say that and things that we couldn't say. So three weeks, uh, sorry, three pieces we submitted. The, the, the final one got, obviously got signed off and we made history for, for poets on the 12th of November, 2020 being the first spoken word group to perform at the Moguls. So my story in regards to how I got into spoken word, this started in, I left London um, March 15th, 2000, March 15th, 2015, Mother's Day, I left London. I left London and I moved to a place called Bognor Regis. Um, before poetry, um, I was a sports person. So my life before poetry, I was, a, I was an ex-professional footballer and Staying in London, I was pretty much kind of on a path of self-destruction. Me, if I had I stayed in London. So um, I was expecting a child and um, I moved down to the South Coast to, you know, help raise my, my, my daughter at the time and start a family. And um, going from London to Bogner Regis was a massive change for me and I started to suffer with depression. So my partner at the time, uh, suggested one of two things for me to get therapy or you know, for me to start writing. So I started writing in uh, 2017. I wrote for a solid year. And then one day I just started to read the things that I wrote back. And then that's what birthed the Tarot Lewis that you see here before you right now.